4467 for the summer session. We're so excited that you guys are here. I'm Kelly and I'm going to be showing you around today. I'm a current student in the class. We're in our last final stretch here, so we have a lot to show you. We have a lot to teach you um, just in a short time, so let's get started. Right over here is where guests are going to check in for their meal. This is the host station, so this is one of the positions that you guys will be holding at some point for the front of the house. So, um, do you have any general advice for the students that are coming for 467 this time? Um, just stay organized and focused and jump in whenever you can if you have any. Yeah. Come on, Camille, you can do better than that. Well. Give us a better answer. <laughs> Brittany, yes. what's your three favorite things about this class? Go. It's eating. Oh, we get to eat? That is true. That's true. true. We get to all interact with new people and make connections and network with new students. Yes. And work together. We're going bowling in about two weeks. <laughs> Lots of beer. <laughs> all right. Well, <laughs> Chef, you'll have to edit that. Let's go. All right. Now we're going to take you on into the dining room. I know. So there are two general sections in the dining room. There's the sort of front and true part. Whoa, falling tree. Nice catch. Kelly, MVP always. She was in my group. How lucky am I? No. You're going to run into lots of little issues like that. People are constantly going to be coming up to you asking you for answers, awesome. and you're going to have to give them the answer. So, this is the second time. Other side of the dining room. Excellent. So, as you can see, there's a variety of different tabletops there's four tops, six tops, eight tops high tops and we'll show you some VIP stuff in the back as well. Nikki two cards. <laughs> hey, hey. We learn other languages in this class. Alright, and this is our micro system right Micros here. Micros POS. You guys are gonna become very familiar with this. Learn it, love Essentially, it. Essentially you're gonna it. have to swipe in and put in all the uh, food orders. It's definitely something you're gonna need. To Ooh Nicole, one of my favorites. Hi. What's your Hi, three do you favorite wanna things? watch me fire some oh, yeah, Sure, works. absolutely. Show us how it works. Okay. Alright. So we're good with picking up your check. Table 44, which is that big eight top over there. I need to fire their desserts now. Fire it. Great. And that's how you do it. How easy was that? It's that simple. Although Nicole, everyone messes up. Today. This is one of the several front of the house roles you're going to be playing. We've got servers, we've got hosts, we've got busters. We've got um, food runners, all sorts of great stuff. And those are the people that you're seeing in the red polo shirts. I'm wearing the back of the house uniform. Those are our chef's coats. He's got a hat, coat, black pants, uh, apron, and non-slip shoes. So you're going to have to get all that, get used to it. It's not pretty, but we all have to do it. Hey, Nicole. Yeah. What advice would you give to management teams? Advice for management team. Delegate your tasks. Make sure everyone's busy. Don't have anyone just standing around. Right on. Learned that last week. <laughs> Thanks. There you go. What are you doing? Oh, Lisa. The girl who didn't know my name until like three weeks ago when she was yelling at me. Now we're best friends. And now we're best friends. <laughs> what advice do you have? for the uh, class. Doing that video. Mm -hmm. Show up every day. Show up every, every day. day. Put a lot of effort into your band. And on the side. Alright, there you go. <laughs> and this is an empty table. We're just going to show you real quick. When it's your time to manage the mail, one of the things you're going to have to decide is how you're going to roll your silverware, your t centerpieces, what color napkins you're going to use. You're always going to have white linen, so you're going to have to try and figure out what makes the table pop for your theme. Okay? Let's head on back to the kitchen. Ooh. My bad. This is our drink station right over here. Drink station. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. See, I'm getting in the way. My bad. Another POS system. Another POS. That's definitely another piece of advice. You're constantly going to be in people's way, but got to get your stuff done. All right, so this is the youngest man to ever graduate UNLV. <laughs> 19 years old. Incredible. Way to make us all feel bad. It's all good. Do you have any advice for the students that are coming in for the summer for this class? Smile is his piece of <laughs> advice. That's excellent. Thank you very much. Wise words from a very wise man. <laughs> all right. This is sort of our prep station where a lot of the food gets brought up. Everyone's got to wash dishes at some point, and this is not the most glamorous job, but everyone's got to wash. Wash for six hours. Yeah. Just 
getting crazy dirty. It's all good. Come on over, Tiara. Any advice for the 467 students? No. Oh, yeah. No. No. No advice. What, what? Okay, never mind. Never mind. She's busy. Cut that part out. Yeah. Ian. Ian. Yeah, my brother. Here. What advice do you have? Your three favorite things about the class? Uh, just come ready to work. Come ready to be in a fury. It's gonna be a lot of work. Uh, fuck it. I'm gonna get out of here. Have it out of my face. <laughs> what do you? What do you? <laughs> <laughs> all right. Well, this is where all the. This is where the hotline comes. This is the hotline. Right here. Chef, what's happening? This is Chef Swift. Fear the beard. Fear the beard. Fear the beard. We will be sending hey. you to your home for five Please, weeks. Please, Matt, look forward to it. Please. Right on. Chef Swift is fantastic. You're going to learn so much from him. He is a little intimidating, but don't be worried The man, the myth, the legend, yes. Cody. All right. What are some uh, management tips you have for the incoming students for 467? Management tips. Make sure you have all your paperwork done. Anyone who asks questions, answer those questions for them. You know, most importantly, just you know, keep everyone with a good spirit, good morale. Right on, Excellent. Cody. Thanks, Cody. We appreciate it. Come clean shaven, too. Working hard. His motive? Hardly working. One of the roles oh, that you on your management team is the executive chef. Executive chefs get to wear this awesome hat. Otherwise, Aaron, you're stuck working with hard. Aaron. Three things, three favorite things this semester. Go. Can't even talk. He's working that hard. Oh really? Okay. You know? All right. Jessica, this is one of our top people as well. You got any advice for the incoming students? Be on time and be organized. What? What are your three favorite three favorite things of the class? My friends. Maybe my teachers and, uh, and the food. It's really fun, you know? It's fun, but you still need to stay focused at the same time. You'll learn a lot, that's for sure. That's for sure. And you guys are definitely going to hit the ground running. Thornberry, what do you got to say? Uh, order up. Order up, baby. All right. <laughs> a phrase you will all become very familiar with. <laughs> oh, man. This is the back area with the VIPs. VIP section. It's pretty cool. Yeah, have all sorts of different freezers back here. This is just an example of what they look like on the inside. Yeah. You're going to become really familiar with all the ingredients that are in here. You're going to know exactly where everything is. And there'll be other instructional videos for you to watch on those as well. Yeah, Chef hooks it up. Kind of overwhelming at first, but just watch him. True, true. This is Chef Swoop's office. This is where he's going to be all the time. Well, unless he's cooking. Which he'll definitely probably be cooking. It's his go-to spot, his domain. So we're just going to head right on in here. This is another classroom setting that you guys might be utilizing this semester. Oh, perfect. One of the hardest working people in this entire kitchen right here. We're doing a video for the students that are coming in from Singapore for the summer for this class. Any advice? Welcome. Um, yeah, just be hard workers. Come with an interest to learn, and I'm sure you're going to have a lot of fun. Not only sightseeing, but also getting to be in the back of the house. So let me know if you need any help. Yep. This is one of the not so glamorous parts of the job, but at some point we all end up cleaning the floors. Luckily, we don't have to get down on our hands and knees. So again, this is one of the classrooms you guys might be utilizing. It's got this demonstration kitchen right here that we're standing in. And this is kind of where um, Chef might show you how to do something, knife techniques, how to uh, we use the oven, and things like that. How to not cut yourself. <laughs> that is and the last thing we have to show you guys is sort of the instructional kitchen. Um, as you can see, there's different stations set up and each station has a stove, a salamander, an oven, its own equipment, um, compost buckets, all that sort of thing. And so this is where you're really gonna get some time to do some hands-on learning um, in individual groups so it's not so chaotic in that uh, commercial kitchen over there. So again, welcome to the UNLV campus here in Las Vegas. We're so excited to have you for the summer. Um, again, some of my pieces of advice, um, don't be afraid to come out of your comfort zone. This class really does push you to limits that um, you may not have experienced before, but don't hesitate to, to just jump on in. Um, we learn by mistakes here, and um, that's okay. Don't worry if Chef yells at you. It probably means that 
you're doing something wrong, but you'll learn from it and he'll come around. Um, it, every, everybody's a little intimidating at first, but it ends up being a whole lot of fun. So let me get you to introduce you to Joe behind the camera. Let him say something for you. Hello. Yeah, welcome. Uh, really enjoy your time at UNLV. It's a great school. Enjoy Chef Swift. He's the man. Uh, he'll ride you hard, but it's just to get everybody um, you know, through the class and learning and, and kind of give you that industry experience that you wouldn't otherwise get in another class. Uh, other than that, really come out of your shell. Enjoy your classmates. You're going to meet people that maybe you haven't already know or know or are comfortable with and then all of a sudden you become uh, friends after school and that's the way I feel about a lot of the people in uh, my graduating class so it's really cool and then I uh, just have so much fun because the class is fun it's demanding but at the end of the day like everyone leaves with smiles on their faces and laughing and full bellies and full bellies yeah with, without a doubt enjoy all the food but enjoy Vegas enjoy UNLV and enjoy the class yeah great thank you very much guys good luck